Hey there YouTube. So a discussion came up recently about what tools do you need to be able to remove the tires from a big truck in order to do basic brake tire bearings, that kind of work on a truck. Now we're actually getting ready to do kingpins on the Mac here and uh, to do that we're going to need to take the tires off. So first off, we have the steer axle jacked up with a pair of 12 ton bottle jacks, air over hydraulic from Harbor Freight. Next we've got one inch drive long anvil tire impact guns. Now I've got two of them, they're both Harbor Freight units. This one here is the first one that I bought and I've had this at least five years, I've abused the heck out of it and it still works flawlessly. This one here I bought several years later I had found myself needing two tire guns. I have a service pickup and when I do long term construction projects a lot of times I take that pickup out on jobs. And then when I would bring truck home for service I wouldn't have an air impact gun if that truck was out on the job still. I've got them both out here because I'm going to show you about air lines. You see this one here which is actually rated for 2000 foot pounds of torque and this one's rated for 1200 and I'll show you that the 1200 foot pound impact gun will seriously outperform the 2000 with the proper air hose. This is a half inch air hose with G style half inch coupling. This one we've got your normal 3 8 inch air hose and a reducer fitting so I can plug this in to show you guys. Now if you're going to dismount and mount your own tires, these are Ken Tool tire bars. They're available from Napa. This bead hammer is also from Ken Tool and also purchased at Napa. For your air compressor, this is my shop air compressor. These are the ratings on it. You'll notice at 90 PSI, the CFM is only 11.5. Those one inch guns will use air faster than this compressor can put it out. It is 60 gallons and it does get the job done. First we're going to use the lower rated impact gun with the big air hose to take the lug nut off. Now, for, now this one is rated for an additional 800 foot pounds of torque. And we're going to try to take next lug nut off with 3 8 air hose. Now you see that it did it, but it really struggled. Back to the other one. But if you don't have one, you don't plan on mounting or dismounting your tires, any kind of long pipe or bar will work just fine. Anyway, I hope that helped you out. You don't have to spend a lot of money on this stuff, and you can build it up over time. You can buy one thing and then another. And a lot of times I'll wait till these things go on sale and I'll add to what I already have. So anyway, thanks for watching. Make sure you stay tuned to next week's video where we disassemble some kingpins and I show you how I got this nasty black eye. Hope you like, comment, subscribe down below. Thank you. Have a good day.